Use 8-bit 2's complements to compute the sums in 31 through 36. Number 33 says negative 6 plus negative 73. So whenever we're computing sums using 8-bit 2's complements, we need to convert both of these decimal representations into their corresponding 8-bit 2's complements. So here's the general procedure for using 8-bit 2's complements to add two integers. First, we have to convert both integers to their 8-bit 2's complement representations. Now, since both of these two integers are negative, that means we have to use a very special process to find the 8-bit 2's complements for both of these. So to find the 8-bit 2's complement for a negative integer, we need to first write the 8-bit binary representation for the absolute value of these two numbers. So the absolute value of negative 6 is 6, which in 8-bit binary representation would be 00000110. The absolute value of negative 73 is 73, which is 01001001 in binary representation. So next we need to switch all the ones to zeros and all the zeros to ones for both of these numbers. After we switch all the ones to zeros and zeros to ones, we need to add one in binary notation. So if we add one to the first number here, 11111001, we'll get 11111010. And we need to add that to the result when we add one to the second number, which is supposed to represent 73 in binary. And so now we need to add one to 10110110, which would be 10110110. And now we need to add these two. And if we have a carry on the very far left row, which we will have, it looks like we have a one plus one here, we have to discard that last carry. So zero plus zero is zero. One plus one is one zero. So we carry the one. One plus one is one zero. Carry the one and so on. One plus one plus one, we haven't seen that yet. One plus one plus one is one one. So we have a one and we need to carry the one. One plus one plus one is one one. So write a one and carry a one. One plus one is one zero. So carry the one. So lastly, we need to do one plus one plus one, which is one one, but we can't carry this last bit here because we only have eight bits. So we discard this last carry and we're left with 10110000. Because this number has a leading one, that means the number is negative. And that's the final answer. Thanks everyone and I'll see you in the next video.